Flavian Pratt, second place finish with Country House. Flavian, what happened out there? Well, uh, we had a pretty good trip, and then uh, when, I, when I came around the town, I, you know, I was outside, and then all of a sudden, uh, there was a real move from the inside to the outside, and uh, kind of bumped me, get me sideways, but I mean, uh, after that, uh, you know, down the lane, I had a fair, fair run, but it just, uh, I want to, you know, the steward to look at it. And do, do you think that contact cost you a win in the Kentucky Derby? Well, I mean, uh, like I say, you know, when I was coming around the town, they, they kind of pushed me sideways, but after that, like I said, in the stretch, I had a fair run. The objection that's taking place right now, they're still looking at it. Are you confident they might make a change and you could wind up the Kentucky Derby winning jockey with Country House? Well, that'd be great. <laughs> <laughs> we will await a decision, guys. All right, thank you. Country House, known as a closer, did just that in this race. Objections happen all the time in racing. There are lots of conversations that go on. The stewards have a difficult job and we continue to go back as they continue to watch the different angles of this race. I, I think the bigger question, Mike, I, I believe that maximum security stepped out of lane and impeded number one War of Will. The question is, did it cost War of Will a placing? Would he have finished better had this not happened? And there's the answer. And that's right the there. discretion of the stewards. And sometimes riders, to be, to be quite honest with you, take a shot. Right? Yeah.